Oat, back to you. All right, Casey Montoya in Norwalk tonight. More to come on the other side of this short break. History is made across the country tonight as voters turn out in record numbers to cast their ballots in the midterm elections. As most political experts predicted, the Democrats have taken control of the U.S. House of Representatives, picking up some key races. And Republicans have maintained control of the U.S. Senate with key wins, including Ted Cruz in Texas and Rick Scott in Florida. You are watching the KTLA 5 News at 10. Good evening, I'm Micah Ullman. And I'm Cher Calvin. We have extensive team coverage tonight with reporters focusing on every major race in Southern California and the nation, as well as a team of analysts breaking down the meaning behind the midterms. Here in California, Democrat Gavin Newsom is projected to be the new governor, defeating Republican John Cox and doing so by a handy margin. And we want to go to um, John Cox's headquarters right now. And actually, we're going to go to Gavin Newsom's headquarters right now, where we're expecting the new governor-elect uh, to uh, give his victory speech. That is his wife speaking right now to their supporters. And let's go over to Mary Beth McDade. MB? And he won. Yes, uh, Sharon Micah, that's correct. This is a uh, filmmaker, Jennifer Seabelt Newsom, and, and she is speaking here right now. She's talking about her husband and how proud she is of him. Tonight really is a night that has been in the making since back in 1996, when uh, that is when Newsom began his political career. San Francisco mayor at the time, Willie Brown, he appointed him to serve on the city's parking and traffic commission and as a member of the board of supervisors then in 1997. He served as mayor of San Francisco from 2004 to 2011, and he has since been the lieutenant governor since 2011. Again, his wife is here speaking, and she is expected to introduce her husband here tonight. There are more than a thousand people in this room. They are celebrating this victory tonight for what was expected to be. Here now is his wife, Jennifer Newsom. And standing by his side. Thank you for being a part.